Brewerites, are you ready? Let's run the clock in three, two, one, go! Our last match of the day of qualification matches, we've got one, we've got two autonomous cubes scored, but only one of them is going to be a bonus on the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance, we've got this incredible Roomba robot getting ready to get their duck off. Yes, they've gotten their duck on the Blue Alliance, gotten their duck on the Red Alliance. This is a pretty standard match so far with a bit of a lead for the Blue Alliance coming out of this autonomous as we're wrapping up our last match of the day. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. And here we are starting the driver operated period. All these robots immediately beginning motion. Only one large bot here. A lot of these bots are a lot smaller. I love the, there's again, some of my favorite bots in this last match of the day. 18527, the team from Iowa. This circular robot is incredible. They use an X drive, which means they've got wheels on various sides of the robot. Instead of it being side by side, they're crossed. GNCE as well is a great robot on my books with this very well printed ABS plastic that keeps them very elegant and simple and well done. And you can see it in action here where they pick up on one side of the robot and drop it on the opposite side of the robot. They're made to exactly to score into the top of their uh, shipping hub. And just like that, Red Alliance as well, 3839 rumbling and tumbling over those PVC pipes and scoring in the top of their shipping hub. The shared shipping hub is getting a lot of action as well. The Quantum Robotics scoring in there alongside the Iowa team. PCM Alchemists. These robots getting these scoring, getting these shipping hubs. Again, this is the last match of the day, which means that a lot of eyes are probably on this match, trying to see scouting, trying to get these alliance selections figured out. With only 40 seconds left in the game, we've got a strong score for the Blue Alliance. We're not seeing much defensive play here either, but that's pretty normal when it comes to... Uh, it's usually defensive play is going to be something that you see further on. As endgame begins here, we're looking at GNC trying to score one of their caps, but it's a little bit precarious. After all, these robots are trying to both get the ducks off and score their team marker on top. Ooh, a little bit of a miss. Maybe they'll be able to do it just in time. There, of course, their alliance partner, 14270, primed and ready with their marker, getting ready to score it as long as their partners can score right before two. Is, are they going to get their score in first? Yes, that's a one score. Can they get the second marker with only four seconds left in the match? Unfortunately, they are not able to do it and miss. The Alliance fully parked all their ducks off, but unfortunately, no markers on top of their shipping hub. This is a solid match from both teams as our, we wrap up our last match, our last qualification match of the day. Teams are going to get ready for alliance selection, get ready for lunch. Again, we're keeping to our regular schedule. So we'll see you all back match at 70, alliance match selection. Match 79 scores up.